All right, welcome back to the Talos Principle. The binary is done. We're done reading this terminal. This very, very time-consuming terminal. Though it did have some interesting stuff going on. And again, I, I can't remember if Galatea actually was someone that we've seen, or if that's just one of those, like, Galatea and... Uh, well, I, I forgot the other ones. There were a couple names mentioned, like, oh, they've been gone for a while. So I guess uh, it's just to show that the world is, like, breaking apart from the outside in. Anyway, like I hinted at last time, we're gonna leave this star for a second, and we're gonna go back to World 3, because we have another installment of... Oops, I solved the puzzle off-camera, unfortunately. So let's go back and take a look at that. So, uh, I, I was just gonna, like, run around... I didn't intend to, I was running around looking for ways to, like, bring stuff out of levels and whatnot, because we've already found ways to, to get stuff out, and I could solve both of the stars at this point, but I wanted to find something that seemed a bit more official, something with auto-jumping, something that felt a little cleaner, and, and so on. So, I was just going through all of the levels off-camera, since it's pretty boring doing that on-camera when we already have a solution, and seeing if we could, like, take things out of all of them and stuff. And I actually did figure out one way in here to make use of an auto-jump to get something out of the, the level and nothing else. Though it doesn't seem intended at all. So we'll do that, but yeah, I don't know. It's still a little weird. And then in doing that, I just realized that, oh, I'd never tried like taking boxes out of Pendulum. Maybe that works. Maybe that's how you get this one. But that wouldn't explain how to get the one inside, because we need something else into the level, I thought. But it turns out that is not entirely true. If we just jump into Pendulum quick... Then, if we... I, I like, went around looking at many different things, like, I had... I was thinking this seemed pretty promising, because we can, like, take the boxes here, and... jump up here, auto-jump up, and then, like, this is a problem where I can't quite... Can't quite get enough height here, even if I bring another... the other cube here. I would, like, need another one or something. So I was thinking I was trying to, like, lean it or something, but that's obviously not something that's intended. But this seemed promising, but I can't see anything there. And then over here as well... Uh, this statue, you can, like, jump up on as well, and uh, I guess I'll show this as well. Again, these are all, like, failed attempts. Oh, no. God damn it. You know what? It's faster just doing this than we have the boxes back here. So if we place the boxes, like, here or something... Double stack them up, or, uh, well, jump up here first. No auto-jumping here, but at least we can auto-jump to this point, and then I thought maybe we can do something here or on this side, but I can't quite find a spot that lets you do that or anything. And then I, I started using this guy, just, like, jumping up on here, because then if you ride this guy, you can, like, jump over here and wait for him to return. We can, like, stack up another box, and... Ah, damn it. And then jump onto here, and this seemed really promising, because then you get an auto-jump here, but I can't take the box again. So it's like we still would need another box to hold in my hand when I'm going through here, because if we, like, drop down in here, we're just in this courtyard that has the star, so we would still need a box here in order to jump over, so I don't really see... Like, th this seems like something that would have something that would be intended, but I don't know. It still seems like we would first need to get a, a box in there, and if we get a box in there, why wouldn't we just, like, drop off here? Because, sure, that's not an auto-jump, but, but that's, like, extremely simple. Just, I, I mean, let's not even show it, but just jumping off the bridge into the courtyard is, like, a simple jump, so surely that isn't not intended, I would think. And then also, while doing this, I found this stuff. If we drop off here and we place the boxes, like, about here, 
This definitely seems like a completely intended thing, and this seems like the solution to the inside pendulum thing. We drop off here, and then we can just auto-jump here, auto-jump again, take a box, and then auto-jump over here, and there's like a whole place to walk here, and you get this like perfect line of sight to both of these, uh, these connector receivers. So, I imagine we have to just somehow also take a connector with us here, and yeah, that that's just the solution to this one, but we could also just break out of a, of a different level, just break some items out, get a jammer out or something, and then that would be very easy to solve as well. So, I guess this one has kind of multiple solutions, but this definitely seems like the proper solution, so let's do it this way, I suppose. So then we have to bring a connector. I'll just leave that one down there in case I need it. And do I hook it up as well? Let's just start with hooking up only these two and we'll see if we need more. Yeah, so now the question is like how do we how do we reach this? That's what I don't exactly know. Like maybe we can No. Because, yeah, this part might still be a little tricky. If I still can't do anything about getting a connector onto here, then it doesn't matter. It doesn't do anything. I also broke these connections, but that's fine. I, I guess we just do it in multiple steps. That should be fine, like, just place this here. Ah, stop. Get up this way, and take the connector up here, and then we stack this up. Yeah, 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 okay. That makes a lot more sense. So we get across here, jump again, leave the connector for a second. Auto jump over here. And now we should be able to connect up. Oh yeah, of course, we need this as well, but does that reach? No, that doesn't have line of sight to everything. So I want to say we probably just connect these up. Because that should have line of sight to both. I'm pretty sure. Let me just confirm again. Yeah, we have line of sight to one. We should have line of sight to the other. And then we should just be able to jump down and get this one to connect this connector up. Just, like, right here, whatever, on top of this thing, maybe. No, can't do that. Okay, we, we could just take a box, I guess. We can just do this and then take a box. Just block this annoying guy. Like so. There we go. And then we just have the ja out the jammer to open the final gate. There we go. Yeah, I think, I think that's the intended solution for this star, but you can also just bring something out of out from outside the, the level, either like an additional connector or an additional box or both or an additional jammer, anything. If you bring anything, this the star is just immediately solved. So that's not too bad, but I didn't find any way to actually take things out of this level in that sense. So I guess we have to make use of this other one for this star. And I'll show you the, the way, the like, not intended, but at least it's an auto-jump way to get something out of BFF. So to begin with, we have to basically just solve the level like normal. So just lock this guy here. Uh, we need to go and... What do we need to do? Uh, I guess, hold on. Let's just jam over here to begin with. And, oh, I don't even need to solve anything. Yeah, we can just do it from right here. The thing is, if you just place a box here, it's slightly raised, and then we can jump up, and there actually is an auto jump here. But you can't see it, it's just a prompt, and then you jump up. So now we can just bring whatever I want, a jammer, a box, and, you know, just break out of the level. And that's very, very simple, so. Uh, let's bring a box, because that's what we need for the other star here. 
Get that auto jump. Oh. Stop. I just wanna... Whoa, Jesus Christ, what? Okay, drop it out. Just wanted to see if I could, like, grab this from up here. But no, I guess you would need to leave at least one... Uh, one cube. But you could get the jammer out, because we could just set up the connectors to hold this open. And then take the, the jammer through, jam this from this side, and then you could get both connectors and two fans if you want to, and the jammer, and one box, but you have to leave one box, but all of that you could get out of the level. So, there we go. That is all I need. And, again, I don't think this is intended, so... I, I don't know. If there's some other way to get a box into Pendulum, or, or what. But I guess I'll take this for now. Oh god, I should not be speeding up on that stupid aqueduct. Yeah, so from right over here, we could go higher as well. From over here, rather. Like, this is just not a very hard jump at all. You, you just jump. You, like, make it well within. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just multiple solutions or something? Yeah, it does auto-jump as well, and there's that star. So, there we go. We're done with World 3. Bit jank. Like, I, I think my solutions are a bit jank. I mean, this inside one definitely makes sense, but we could also have done that in a different one. And, yeah, I mean, you can definitely, without using auto-jumping, you can get tons of stuff out here. I think someone showed a screenshot of, like, Pretty much every single object in this this map just gathered up outside in the main hub area. Because, yeah, you can do that. Especially, like, if we get a box out, the, the walls on Ray Trivia are, like, super short. So you can just take all of those out. And you could probably get pretty much everything out if you really wanted to. But I, I don't really want to. So <laughs> we're going to leave that. But, yeah, there we go. World 3 is done. And now we can go back to World 4 and... See if we can figure out that other star, which seems super easy. Like, it seemed like I had the solution already when I looked at it last time, but we'll see. Alright, we're here. Though, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to resolve a lot of stuff here so we can get everything out, but I guess I can at least do that from this side. That might take away one step that you would normally need to do. So, we'll see. At first, I can just do this. And just jam that. Uh, I mean, I, I guess I'll just go further in. Um. Yeah, I guess you can't do anything like this. Wait, can you? No. That would be interesting if you could. Yeah. There's only one dedicated spot that's like, now it's on this button, otherwise it doesn't work like that. Okay. So, uh... We'll have to do a little bit of recording to get everything back again. Guess I'll do it from here. Should be fine. Uh, why am I doing this again? Um... Hmm. How do I... Hmm. Wait. Wait, no, I don't even need the jammer here. I'm like, I'm trying to get everything back here. I, I don't need to do that, I just need to get the connector back, right? We need two connectors, where's... Where's the second connector? I forgot where the second connector is. Yeah, wait, where is that? There were two connectors, I'm pretty sure, right? I am almost certain there were two connectors. Was there only one connector? I guess we only had one connector. Well, damn. 
In that case, I guess I don't really have the solution done. I thought we had access to two connectors so I could have, like, one here, sending it to here, sending to, like, a, a clone over here, and then in here. Where did I get the idea that we had two connectors from? And if we don't have two connectors, how the hell do we... Ah! Ah! How the hell do we send the uh, the connection? I see. Okay, alright. Well, this one was more complicated than I thought in this case. So instead, we have to do this kind of thing. Auto jump up here. And then, like, set this up somewhere. Is there, like, a, a specific spot? That they're like, you will want to place it here. Maybe. Not really. Sometimes they have those where it's like... A pedestal that will just lock in place. So you need the connector there. But I guess just like up here. It's probably fine. So if we do that. And then we record. And we just leave this for a good long while. There we go. Oh, and stop it. Now, I should be able to just take this connector, connect it up, and just jump outside. Go in this, this way. We don't have a, a fan here, but that should be fine. Yeah, and there's even, like, I think that's intended. That's like a little pedestal. Yeah. And there we go. Okay, still a simple star, but more complicated than I thought. And pretty fun. I like that one. Because, yeah, this one again, like... No, it doesn't, like, lock in place, but, I mean, surely this is intended. That that seems very... very perfect. So, hopefully that's right. I mean, I got it. So that's all that matters, really. But there we go. That is that level entirely done, as far as I can tell. And we can, like, take stuff out of it. But I, I can't really do anything with that, can I? Like, sure, I can take a connector or a jammer or a fan or something over here, but... Yeah, that's not going to help me with this whole auto-jumping business. No auto-jumping here, but we, we can do it. Oh yeah, I was thinking, I, I tried to jump over there... I should try jumping over here as well. There could be something there. So, uh, how did we do this again? Where was the, uh... Oh, it was here. Yeah. This auto jump. To here. To there. But again, it's like... I mean, I, I guess, yeah, this, this surely is, like, intended jumping up here, but then... Oh, god damn it. It's very slippery. Yeah, I, I guess I can't quite jump up. I thought this was, like, sticking out more so I could actually jump to it. Doesn't seem like we would be able to get to this side. So it is just here, but like, ah, screwed it up, at least I didn't fall all the way down. It is just here, but even this doesn't seem quite right. Now I can't even do it. I don't know how I did it the first time. I just like somehow perfectly jumped. No idea. I don't know how I did it. I guess I'm going to ignore it. I read that, right? Yeah, Einstein. Alright, never mind. We'll have to see if I can figure something else out here. Uh, so what do we do? Fans and connectors. This one is fans, boxes and connectors. This is the castle thing. This one seems interesting, but I guess I might want to leave that one for last, because it looks important. This one over here had... Wait. Oh, there we go. Boxes and fans. So yeah, they all have like different ones. Let's go to this one. Yeah, the other one with auto jumping. 
That's also really strange. Wait, there's nothing in there, is there? There's no auto-jumping, but... No, nothing hidden. I'm surprised it doesn't auto-jump to here, so it's like... It's not just auto-jumping in places where it makes sense. Where it's like, yeah, you can make this jump, so we'll make it for you. It's specific, you should make these jumps. We have intended for you to do this jump. Those are the only ones that get auto jumps. Alright, well, never mind that. Probably won't have too much time to do this one. I'm just gonna, like, take a peek in, I guess. Take a look around, see what we have to work with. Oh! That looks like a secret of some kind. I mean, let's just jump for it. Nope, I didn't even jump. Oh, I should probably, like, enter the level, so I, uh... Good. Oh, this is the wrong one. I should just enter the level so I, uh, checkpoint. And that just takes me back. Colliding beams. Very big field. Force field. We get some nice water. With nothing in it. No secret wall. Anything? Pretty interesting looking island here. Compared to the, the other one with the like wooden fence. More ruins. Oh, hello. Okay. Maybe we can do... Ah, auto-jumping. Auto-jumping. There we go. This makes sense. Okay. Screw this level. Let's go do auto-jumping. I mean... I don't think I could, like, make this. But this might be something we have to contend with at some point. But yeah, there we go. We got a box. We can definitely take it out of here because of the auto-jumping. And then we can take it up there. But I don't know exactly where we're gonna, like, go from there, what that's gonna do, but this is definitely the intent of this. We do this, get it in here, go all the way up here, and we could get to, like, different places. We could probably jump from here to there if we want to, but I guess that doesn't really matter. Let's just go to the place where it seems like we want to go. So, like, if we jump, if we place it here, maybe that's not what you're meant to do. We don't get an auto jump here, but we can take it into, like, a different level. We could take it to, to yeah, it might be in here. So maybe we want to see if we need a box somewhere outside of that level, because otherwise, it doesn't seem like I can jump anywhere in particular in the hub area here. So that's probably it. We just want to take a box from here to here, probably for a star, I would imagine. So I might have gotten lucky and just basically solved a star that I haven't even seen yet, but we'll see. So I should just keep in mind that I can basically have an extra box in any of these islands. I mean, maybe not any. I don't know if I can take these like out here or anything. Like, we could, we could do what we're intended to do here. Yeah, there we get auto-jumping, and I can take this again, but then we don't get auto-jumping here. Yeah, that's weird, but we could jump out if I want to. So I could get... Wait. Oh, th this is just going back, so that would be... There would be no point. You know what I mean? You can, you can jump here, I guess. But maybe not all the way up. We can definitely jump here. There we get an auto jump, and we can take it. So I would argue that's a, a potential one, but not like we need a box over here. 
And I guess let's just get up here. Just to confirm. Ah, this might be something we can do. Oh, come on. You want to auto-jump that, don't you? That should be an auto-jump. I'm just going to jump it. Yeah, there we go. See? Anything? It doesn't have to be an auto-jump if it's an easter egg, so there could still be something hidden that you're actually meant to see here. Uh... Doesn't look like it, though. Oh god. How do I get back to the box? There we go. I don't seem to be able to take it again. Maybe if I place it more over here? No. Still no auto-jumping. And I can't reach it. No. Alright. Well, can't see anything else there. I might be able to jump up here. I'll probably try that next time again. But we'll leave it here for today. A lot of interesting stuff going on. I'm almost more interested in World 4, like, as a world, than actually the puzzles in the world. A lot of interesting places to jump and now secrets to find, possibly. We'll check it out more next time. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye!